Hello and welcome to this video. I'm going to show you how you can upgrade the Cisco switch CBS 350 60p. So this switch is the it's used for IP phones and it's the PoE switch and I need to upgrade the firmware. The current version of the firmware when you log into the switch and go to the system summary it will show me the current version of the firmware is this version. So to find out the latest version and upgrade, I just go to this Google and use the exact device model with firmware download. I will try this, this one, Cisco Business Series Managed Switches. Okay, yeah, that's it. Okay, as you can see, it's include all the switches. I will go down, choose the download tab, and I will find my Cisco model. That's it. Okay, as you can see, I have three version later. This is the latest version, and I will download the latest one. Start to download. Three three zero sixteen. That's the latest one. I see a box with these switches that the PoE didn't work on some of the ports, and after upgrade, that issue was resolved. So I believe that's the common issue, and I see it in the Cisco room before some discussion about this problem. Okay, I will go back to my switch and go to administration, file management, and framework operation. Okay, after come to this page, I need to browse and import that Framework. So that's the file I just undownload. And click on apply. It start to upload the file. It take some minutes. I just pause the video and will resume after finish. So it just finish and as you can see I get this notification here. And now after the framework was updated we need to click on this option swap image. After the swap image as you can see, that's the file I just uploaded, the version 33016. I will choose this one and then apply. Now I need to reboot my switch, active image were version number after a reboot. So I will click on the reboot and choose immediate. Uh, for the PoE switches, usually it take around 10 minutes. So just be patient, and after 10 minutes, check your switch status. I will pause this video and continue after upgrade was done. Uh, just 10 minutes passed, I will try to log into my switches. Okay, it looks it has done. I will enter my username and password. Okay, I will go to system summary and
as you can see, this is my framework version, the active image. Also, I can show you in the administration. And as you can see, the active image is this version. Now my switch is upgraded. I hope you learned something from my video and please subscribe to my channel if you find this video useful for you.